Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how I apply my false nails at home. The products I used are the McCart 500 nail tips that I got off of Amazon for only $8. The link will be down in the description box below. Nailene's Ultra Quake Nail Glue, which is also linked down below. A nail file, nail polish removal with acetone, a nail clip, a base coat, but since I only have a top coat, I'll use that. Also a sheet of paper just to remove any excess glue. To start, I'll take a cotton ball with the nail polish remover to remove any glue or nail polish that I had on my fingers. Then I'll wash my hands thoroughly. I'm then going to apply the top coat to my nails. I just feel like this helps to protect my natural nails. Next, I'll file the top coat to make it more greasy so the glue can stick, then I'll wash my hands. I also clip my nails to a short length because it tends to make my fake nails last longer. The Macar nails came with 10 pouches of different sizes and I've already separated the ones that I have already used and placed the ones that can't fit in the second pouch which I will put back into the bag. So my sizes were 1, 7, 5, 6 and then 8 which is not shown here. When sizing I placed them firmly on my nail and then look on each side to make sure that my nail was covered and also that the fake nail wasn't over my skin. Then I pushed the nail gently into my cuticle to push them back and to shape them into the nail itself. When I found the right size for each nail, I like to lay them out so that I can grab and go. Next, I apply the nail glue onto my natural nail and also add a drop or two onto the fake nail itself. Then I'll place the nail onto my natural nail and then push it into my cuticle and press firmly to make them look as natural as possible. This is where the paper towel comes in to wipe away any excess glue. I will keep pressing the nail firmly for about 15 to 20 seconds to make sure that it dries. Just repeat these steps for the rest of the nails and they will turn out like this. Now we'll have to file away the little tips that you see at the end. You could stop here and rock the nails how they are right now, but I wanted more of a ballerina slash coffin nail look, so I'm going to file the sides as well. So this is the end result of filing my nails. All that's left is to apply a color and I'll use H&M's Olive Grove nail polish and Forever 21's gel finish top coat and as you can see I'm not a professional when it comes to applying nail polish but all I did to remove the mess was take a q-tip dipped in non-acetone and I'll repeat non-acetone nail polish removal and just rub this away and that is it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Follow me on Instagram, Tumblr, and Snapchat. Bye!